Hi there, it's me and Monty here. We're going to do the uh, my pet tag. And my pet is a dog, and his name is Monty, and he's being a little cuddly bug because I just gave him a bath today and tripped up his paws. And now he's super soft and cuddly, and I can't stop cuddling him. So the questions for the tag are, what's your pet? My pet is a dog. He's a papillon. A papillon is a French breed of dog. Um... That it means butterfly, and I don't have the greatest photo. Yeah. His ears look are upright, look big, they're symmetrical. He looks like a butterfly, hence the name Papillon. There is a downward eared version of the Papillon called a Filen, or a Filen, I don't know how to pronounce it, and it's like a certain type of moth. So there's the moth and there's the butterfly. They're the same breed, they're just different um, ear shapes. So they're, they're both shown as Papillons. Uh, what else about patios? They're the smartest of the toy breeds. They're highly active, but can also be, they're like a big dog in a little dog's body. And uh, they're very intelligent and active, but also couch potato. So it, it, it's a great dog. Um, people often say Mary Antoinette had papillons, but papillons have only actually been with the upright ears for about 100 years now. Maybe not even that. So what she had was like kind of the predecessor to the Papillon. Um, seriously, he's really cuddling right now. Okay, so the next question, what is their names? His name is Monty. His full name is Monty Fox. Monty Fox Oliver, I guess. Um, how old are they? He will be five on April 30th. So he's almost five years old. Where did you get them? I got them from a private breeder. Uh, it's actually someone I know. Um, they had a Papillon and uh, is registered with the Canadian Kennel Club and um, actually one of their family members used to breed Papillons so they got it through them and when they decided it would be a great idea to breed her so they arranged through their family member who breeds to arrange for an appropriate sire or stud that is also Canadian Kennel Club registered and appropriate genetic match so that the puppies are the healthiest they can be and then they had a litter of three dogs, and um, they kept one, and they gave one to their brother, who I also know, and I groom as well, and I got Monty. So that's how we got Monty, and he is Canadian Kennel Club registered as well, um, because we got through that channel, and that was actually something that was very important to me, to have a registered breed. Um... Okay, so the next one is, why did you want this particular breed? Um, so I wasn't necessarily looking for a Papillon, but I was looking for a small dog to keep me company and to be a part of my life, something I could take on the bus, someone I could um, spend time with, someone I could cuddle love. Because um, I was just itching for a pet because I hadn't been living with my cat when I left him at my dad's. And... Um, and Richard had been, uh, my partner, he had been working a lot. Uh, he had been working six days a week, 12-hour days, and I just wasn't seeing him much. So I was lonely. I was looking for a small dog, one that was smart, one that was great, um, apartment-friendly. And I was thinking of maybe a Boston Terrier or a Min Pin, but uh, I didn't know, and I was really insecure. And um, my coworker said, why well, didn't get a Papillon? My, you know, my brother's breeding his Papillon. You, you've met her. I was like, oh my gosh, that's perfect because, as I said, the parents were breeders for like 35 years of the breed. Uh, they had very low genetic or hereditary problems. Um, they're, they're a smart dog. They're great. They're everything I was looking for. So I said, yes, 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 yes. I met the puppies. I fell in love with Monty. He was the right aptitude for me. I, I had to get it. Uh, so that's how I got Monty. So, uh, do they know any tricks? Monty and I do agility together. So agility is a sport with dogs and owners. So it's a team sport and I'm not a good teammate. Um, this is an example of what Monty does. Uh, he climbs an A-frame, but they also run and jump, go through tunnels, um, do a high walk, do a teeter-totter. It's quite a physical sport, but he loves it. He is never as happy as when he's doing agility. So yeah, he does tons of tricks. He also, um, I've trained him that he can do um, his commands 
by hand as well as by voice. So often when he is getting annoying the crap out of me, when I'm trying to focus, like in our classes, our, our agility classes, I will just hand signal him to doing a bunch of tricks while I listen rather than me talking to him. Um, it's also convenient in case they can't hear you but they can see you or if they lose their hearing later or if they lose their sight later they can hear you so it's good for them to know both. Um, do they snuggle, give kisses, follow you around? Yeah, 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 yeah. He likes to cuddle. He likes to give kisses. Uh, he doesn't like it when if we're both home, if one of us aren't together, he wants us both together a lot. It's kind of annoying on that end. Super cuddly. Loves to give kisses, but not so much to me. And are they some... What are some funny things that they do to make you laugh? Um, Monty does a bunch of things. And I think some are just being Monty. But uh, we say he sasses. He, like, when he wants something, he does a sneeze. And it's... Achoo, achoo, and he's sassing us. And uh, sometimes he... He has a mat that he's in love with. So every night at 7, 7.30, he loves his mat, and it's quite funny. And he likes to do that in front of company for some reason. And, uh, yeah, we can't stop him at this point. It's five years later. But it's always quite humorous. Um, I just generally love this guy, and everything he does makes me happy. So he's a, I think he's getting hot under the lights and me holding him. Monty, you gonna say hi? Monty's a papillon. Do you know you're a papillon? I've heard people say, hey, look at the papillon, and you barked at them, because you know. Okay, so we are going to, thank you for watching our tag, and we are going to tag anyone out there with a pet, because I want to know about your pets. So thanks for watching. Give your little one a cuddle. Say bye-bye, Monty. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching. Bye.